Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Shayma Bahar. I am Quran teacher. Inshallah, I will step by step with you to learn the Tajweed rule. Today, inshallah, we will study lesson two in Tajweed rules. Today, we will study together Al Qalqala. In this video, we will learn what the meaning of Qalqala and the letters of Qalqala and the examples and the types of Qalqala. In the first, we will recognize the meaning of Qalqala. Qalqala means vibration. It's the vibration of sound at the end of the pronunciation of a letter. It can be stated as a state between a second letter with school time on it and the mutahadic letter with movement. Letters of Qalqala, there are collected in the words Qutbijat or Qaf, Ta, Ba, Jim, Da. When you make vibration in, in any of these letters, you say Aqqa. The types of Qalqala, weak, strong, strongest. Weak, the letter of Qalqala in the middle of the word. Examples, Sadarak, Atu'amahum, Al-Abtar. Strong, the letter of Qalqala in the end of the word. Example, Ahada, as Hasada, strongest, the letter of Qalqala in the end of the word and has shadda. Examples, al-hajj, al-haqq, watab. Qalqala is only pronounced when the letter is taken. Either the letter has the sukun sign on it or is a signal the second because of stopping, because of stopping. When you say ahad, wallahu ahad, you stop, you stop here ahad. But when you say qulhu wallahu ahad, ahad lillahu samad, when you continue, don't make vibration. Okay, because qalqala. You should make qalqala when the letter is taken only. But if the letter has vowels, don't make qalqala. Okay? Now it's time to leave you. It's a great to see you today. Please, if this video is useful for you, don't forget to make like, share, and subscribe. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.